is nigh. My time to bring the orb or die. Well, good tonight, Jack. Jenkins on the cricket. My undead lords within the core, your name I hail. Enfold the orb! What the heck? Donande tak, donande tek, a room mental said. Damn. You know I do! Damn TV! Lousy second-rate candle makers. Kill them all when I rule the world. What sort of half-baked operation do they think I'm running here? <laughs> now where was I? da 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 Yeah. Oh yeah. I call upon the power of one dark name. One black heart. One grievous soul. I call upon the power of... Primorum Santissima! What the? Oh, 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 oh. At last, the power of the orb is mine, and with it the souls of the dead. Soon I shall rule triumphant over all the <laughs> Blazes! What manner of demon spawn dares attack my ship? Off you, mutant imp, or you'll have no head to put a hat on! Wait, please! I need your help! I don't know what's happened or where I am or... What is this place? No place at all, except the clouds. But off the noble Julian you go, under your power, or by the lift of my boot! Ah! Hold on, what's this? It's my TV. Hmm, and what does this TV do? Do? Uh, it doesn't really do anything. You just watch it. See, here's where you plug it in, and this knob changes the channels. I think it's broken. Intoxicating. The look of it promises a host of mysteries. You should see it when it's on. Give me the glass box, Imp, and I'll spare you your deadly plummeting fate. Why do you keep calling me Imp? My name is Jack. Granted, you've no wings, but you fly like an Imp. I can't fly. I fell. I fell here from my living room. Fell from what? No matter. It's either overboard with gravity as your guide, or I take the TV as fair for safe passage. <laughs> Deal? Can you take me home? Tina made bacon tonight. Bacon bound we go, Imp. But first, I need your help with something. When following your destiny's particular path, the way of the conjurer, a discreet and undetected arrival is more often the best policy, lad. Here, at the abandoned manor mines, you'll find a tunnel which takes you into the very heart of the village of Ix. Once there, you must find the Master Conjurer of Ix, Aldwin. I'll bring you no further, lad. Too many prying eyes the closer we get by air to the village of Ix. Follow the tunnel which leads to Ix. Find my old friend, Aldwin. He'll help you if he can. Take this staff. Forest beasts will heed its bite should they threaten. Careful as you go, lad. Don't, don't.
Yeah, dope, dope. Fine tavern is straight ahead. An excellent respite after so long a journey. What is your goal, do you remember? Aldwin is your goal. You cannot undertake your sacred conjurer studies without him. To find Aldwin in a village of conjurers might require getting to know the village better, so it knows you, so to speak, eh? It wouldn't hurt to get to know the mayor, since you need his permission to leave Ix when you're ready to go. But above all, keep your mind on the goal, lad. Aldwin, find Aldwin. Let's get to know each other. Buy something!
Greetings, citizens of Ix. I come bearing gifts for the future subjects of my queen, Hakuba. Get away from me, filthy peasants! No doubt you're here for the archery contest. I've got a real nice bow for sale. Since I like your face, I'll let it go for 100 gold. Are you interested? There you go! That bow was made for you! You can't lose the contest with a bow like that. Your gold is always welcome here. Are you entering the archery contest? If so, you'll need your own bow and an entrance fee of 20 in gold. We provide the arrow. Well, do I enter you or not? Oh, that necromancer just vanished before my very eyes. Huh? Did you see where the necromancer went? He couldn't have just vanished. Old one the conjurer. Yeah, I know of him. Something of a hermit. Go on the path east out of town across the bridge. You'll find it. Well, the mayor is kind and gentle, but his outbreaks are becoming a nuisance for the whole town. I just saw a huge spider crawl toward the mayor's house. Hope he's all right. He's deathly afraid of spiders. Sorry, you can't leave without Mayor Theogren's permission. It's meant for your own good. The wilds hold far too many perils for the common man. Huh? Spiders have infested the mayor's house. trouble and you won't ever have to see the inside of one of these cells.
Do you know what you want, stranger? Or are you just killing time here? Huh? Sorry, you can't leave without Mayor Theogren's permission. It's meant for your own good. It's a disaster. Spiders are Mayor Theogren's greatest fear, and a swarm has nested in his study. He's locked himself away and won't come out till the spiders are gone. A conjurer named Olvu lives outside of town to the east. We need him to charm the spiders and liberate our besieged mayor. Are you entering the archery contest? If so, you'll need your... All right, everything looks in order. Go on in. The official will explain the rules. Good luck. Huh? I'm today's contest judge. Today's best score is 8 out of 10 hits on the target. You need at least 9 to win. Each entrant gets a quiver with 20 arrows. This one is yours. Take it to the firing line when you're ready. Ready, set, begin! Congratulations to our new champion archer. Your prize is 50 gold pieces. <clears throat> huh? Sorry, you can't leave without me. It's a disaster. Spiders are Mayor Theogrin's grip. I don't talk to underlings. Huh? Huh? Did you see where the necromancer went? Huh? 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 Ew! I watched that huge spider crawl right. Charming wolves. Huh? Greetings. My name is Henrik. I charm and tame the local wolves to keep the countryside safe for travelers. Sorry, mate. The bridge is washed out. Only way across the stream is there, through the urchin den. But if you choose that route, mate, Keep your guard up. The urchin stole my best boots when I was bathing. If you bring them back, mate, I'll teach you a damn fine spell. Ah! 
Hey! Sorry, mate. The bridge is what?
Go, Boots. I never thought I'd see him again. I'm eternally grateful, mate. Here's the spell, as promised. Greetings. I am Master Conjurer Aldwin, and you are sent by the captain, eh? Well, there is indeed room for one more apprentice, but you must pay thirty in gold for your charm creature spell. Do you accept my offer? Very well. This book has a spell to charm creatures. The scroll is a field guide to spiders, which allows you to charm them. Stay nearby when charming a creature. If you move too far away before the charm has set, it will break the spell. Once a creature is charmed, you may banish it from this world 
or make it obey your commands. Take the elevator down to the cellar, then find a tunnel which leads directly to the magic shop in town. You will encounter scores of spiders down there. Practice your new spell on them. We use only the best ingredients for our wares. Thank goodness, oh. a conjurer. Oh. Come on inside. The mayor is still held up in his. Finally, a conjurer has come to my aid. Did it? They're gone? <laughs> really gone? I'll be right out. Huh? Brave Conjurer, my deepest thanks. You are worthy of your new title. The guards will be informed that you are now free to come and go from Ix as you please. Take this gold as payment for your service. I insist. Let's get to know each other. Buy something!
I heard how you dealt with Mayor Theogren's spider problem. Well done! Wild beasts have invaded the mana mines, threatening many workers. One from our ranks must go, take charge, and tame these abominable creatures. I have an uneasy feeling about the timing of this violence at the Mana Mines, lad. Brutal attacks against our miners by strange creatures, immediately halting production just when we got it up and running again. Our hour of need is nigh. Drive out the creatures, lad. Save the captured miners and get back here in one piece. <coughs> hey. Good luck in the mines, boy. Watch out for the bandits. Huh? The mana mines are to the west of the... Don't, don't. You're not going to find anybody around here with better prices.
Welcome to our hallowed shop. We offer goods for the full range of a conjurer's needs. Your gold is always welcome here. Good luck in the mines, boy. Do that! Ah. Ah. 
You're not going to find anybody around here with better prices. Welcome. New here, aren't you? Your money is still good with me. Welcome to our hallowed shop. We offer goods for the full range of a conjurer's needs.
My spectacles! You brought them back! May all that is great bless you! And please take this scroll. It contains all I've learned about bats. It would be invaluable to any conjurer. Don't, don't. You have arrived. Lives are at stake. Please hurry to the mines just west down the path. The foreman is waiting for you outside the miner's lodge. He'll direct you from there. Oh. What took you so long to get here? We have a horrible problem. Horrific overgrown insects and airborne demons from the underworld have overrun the mines. Mine workers have died in defense of Nox's vital interests. Please, we beg you, clear the beasts from the mines, rescue my miners, and I shall reward you handsomely. This key will unlock the door to the first trap mine worker. He will help you find the others. I also have a beast scroll which should be quite useful.
Hey, so, so. Go. So. Go. So. Five workers are trapped in the mines below us. If we hurry, we may be able to save all of them. Follow me. I can guard and operate the elevators while you search for the workers. Take this key and use it to release the first worker. He'll have another key to give you when you free him. Let's go. Follow me. Over here! I'll wait here! Hey, John! John. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you for freeing me. Please help me back to the elevator. I used this key to lock myself in here. Take it. You need it to release another trapped worker. That was too close. 